Welcome back, guys. I think this is uh, this is it. This is the final episode. Hopefully, bro. I don't know how long this game is, but holy shit, it's actually like it's longer than I thought. I think we're definitely nearing the end, though. Here we go. I'm gonna end this loop. Once and for all. Don't you dare go outside! I can't open that. I can open this. Oh fuck. No hope. The Silent Hill phenomenon. The suicide rate has increased around the world in large part due to the struggles brought uh, on by the COVID-19 pandemic. With countries still unsure how best to handle the issue, these trying uh, times have also given rise to a strange phenomenon in many areas. Those affected suddenly claim to see fog, even fair weather days even on fair weather days you lose consciousness shortly after this has come to be known as the silent hill phenomenon named after a similar event that occurred in uh, eponymous u.s town oh so it, it, i guess that's how it's connected to the silent hill uh, game the silent hill universe the first to propose a theory explaining why this could be happening is dr triple x the fuck xxs tentacion a social psychologist at X University who had the following to say on the matter To one who is psychologically unstable, uh, fog represents uncertainty and sensory illusions When in a state of high stress, one's vision may become obscured or tunneled As if one is wandering through a dense fog or mist Societal uncertainty or apprehension about the future manifests as fog Thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. As time goes on, we are seeing more and more cases of this uh, silent hill phenomenon. In response, Dr. Triple X calls for a rapid uh, rebuilding of society as well as a stronger emphasis on counseling and mental health care for the young. Okay. No exit. No, what? No, fuck. No, what the fuck does that say? Am I blind? No exit. No future. No future. Oh shit, what the fuck's happening to my phone? What's going on? No hope. This is our living room. Okay, I'm invisible. No reflections. L game. December 29th, 2011. I finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought I found my happily ever after, but it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost everything. I, st I still have my children, my cute little angels who light up my life. There's a wine bottle right there. Yo, this looks good. Like, visually, this looks really good. Oh, is that, uh... The hell? Sounds like fucking... Sounds like kids playing outside. Okay, some jam. Whatever that is. Wait, this is a loop. Wait! What the fuck? Whoa! Why 
Pizza right there. February 10th, 2012. My new man showed up to my place today with pizza. Children definitely need a father, but they still won't take to uh, won't won't take to him. He looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. Won't take or won't talk to him. I hope he doesn't hate me. February 22nd, 2012. My daughter drew a picture of our family who was smiling and holding hands. I wish she would have, uh, she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She's slower than other, other kids her age. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. Who's she talking about? Fuck. Wait, why is everything big? I'm giving up my life for you. I think this is like this is like kid Anita. Or Anita when she was a kid. March seventh, twenty twelve. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands from the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza though. She's extremely picky. I shall probably teach her uh, to eat things she doesn't like. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. March 22nd, 2012. The kiss finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said uh, he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with them. We need him for a happy life, and I need them to realize that. I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. April 12, 2012. He told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? He doesn't visit as much as he used to. If, uh, if I don't figure out something out... I may never see him again. What the fuck? What the hell? May 9th, 2012. Everything seems to be going well. Now that we've been going out on dates. He was worried about my kids, so he bought them a bunch of books and toys. That should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it. But by the time I get back, I have no energy. May 25th, 2012. I got contacted by the Child Welfare Center. I guess some nosy bitch or asshole in my building reported hearing a child crying at night in my place. The fuck did they know? He hasn't called me much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is enjoying life. While I'm working my ass off raising kids, why am I the fucking bad guy? July fifteenth, twenty twelve. If I hadn't, if if I hadn't had children, maybe we, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. Wait, I think I know where this is going. It's the witch. Nah, that would be a crazy plot twist. What the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? Bro, if this is true, this is fucking crazy. Is this thing gonna stop, bro? Miss Krista Planet, we have reached out to you repeatedly, but have yet, uh, yet to receive a response. We take this to mean 
we take we take this to mean you have no intention of uh, remedying this issue. You are no, uh, you are in violation of German Civil Code Article 16, Section 2. Accordingly, the federal court has instructed us to take your children. Should you have any objections to this, please contact us as soon as possible. Bro, what the fuck? Frank Fisher, Kettenstad Child uh, Welfare Center. Oh, hell no. Boy found dead in refrigerator, mother arrested. What the fuck? Yo, nah, 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 nah. What the fuck? Yo, where the fuck is this going? Boy found dead in refrigerator, mother arrested August 4th, 2012. A boy was found dead uh, today in a refrigerator in the home of his 41 year old mother, person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. And when she noticed she, uh, he wasn't moving the next morning, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to uh, determine the cause of death. Yo, what the fuck? Nah, bro. According to the investigation, person A daughter ran into a neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrig uh, refrigerator and arrested the mother after she confessed to her crime. Uh, you just me, man! No. You can just stay in there! This took Let a crazy time. Ah! This is all your fault. Bad things happen because of you. you never have been born. You're a burden. A curse. You're my mother. mother. Yeah, that's exactly it. My mother yelled at me. This room here in the villa. That was fucking nuts. I tried so hard to forget this place. Holy shit, man. Another fucking chasing scene. Here we go. Oh, oh hell no. Yeah, I'm dead. the fuck here we go again I'm sorry mom so that's that's li that's our mother the 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 monster that's been chasing us this whole time to look at our mother that's crazy Quick! Oh fuck! You're into art, right? You 
could audit an art class. Bro. Holy shit, man. What is happening? That thing is still chasing me, I know. Oh my god. GG's. I'm dead. What are you hiding inside? Bro. There she is. Come this way. <laughs> oh fuck. I think I have to find all the fucking photographs. Bro. Quick! There's another one. There's another one. Is that a photograph? Am I tripping? Bro. She's coming. Oh my god, man. Oh my god. I have to go the Nah, this is the wrong way. It's the wrong way. Really, bro? Really, bro? The fuck? You're, you're joking, right? This is a joke. Okay. Oh, I have to find that door. Okay, okay, I see it, I see it, I see it. I have to find that door. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh, she getting quicker. Oh hell no. Oh my god, I see a photograph. I really like what you're doing, Baba. Bro. Holy fuck. There we go, there we go, there we go. There it is. Wait. Oh my god, it's not open. I almost fumbled that. Oh my god, I almost fucking fumbled that. I need one more, I need one more. I need one more fucking photograph. We just one more. I need to look around for this shit. Oh, left this time. Maybe it's when one of these. What the fuck am I doing, man? What's... Okay, there is one there. Oh, fuck, bro. Yo, look how fucking quick she is, bro. Fuck. 
Nah, let's try this way. I think I've been here before. Wait, is that it? No. Hey, bro. And this game like helped me out. What am I missing? I know I'm missing a photograph, but like, where the? Oh, run, 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 run! Holy fuck! Yes, no. Got that one already. This room maybe? Oh, wait, maybe. Maybe. Yes! Wait! Oh no, I got that, I got that, I got that. Wrong, wrong. It's the wrong fucking room. 210, I've been to two, I think I've been here before. Actually, maybe not. Wait, maybe not actually. Is this it? Yes, wait. Holy fuck, man. Fuck away from me, bitch. Bitch is so quick. Oh my god. I'm losing my mind, I'm losing my fucking mind. I'm losing my mind. He's everywhere. Okay, so it's not 209. It's not 210, I've been to 210. I've been here before. 211, I've, have I been to 212? Let's try 212. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I see a fucking photo. Ooh. Is it is it that? Wow. Running like a fucking grandma. Oh shit, I would be sprinting if this is me. I would be fucking gone. Nope. I've been to 211. I've been to bro. Am I just like Oh fucking shit? Boom! My phone starts tweaking like that, that's how you know I'm close. Oh! Wait! 
Oh my god. Oh my god. This is it. What's it's that? fucking open. Oh. You like what you see? Yo, the door is open. It's open, it's open, it's open. Holy fuck, it's open. That took so long. That took so long. Am I gonna be alone forever? Yo, that took ages. Holy fuck. I'm gonna have to edit that whole fucking part out because that took fucking ages. Holy shit. Okay, what now? February 21st, I've been really absorbed in my work lately. I decided to paint the girls who jumped off the villa roof. I'd like to think they left this place for something better. I think I might finally be free of my despair because I've never felt this inspired. I'm going to put every last bit of myself into this piece. March 4th, my roof piece is almost done. It might actually be my crowning achievement. But once this is done, then what? Do I have it? Do I have it in me to come up with something even better? How much longer can I enjoy the fame and praise I get now? Is there despair and disappointment waiting for me around the corner? The sadness that gripped me before has clawed its way back into my mind. I guess it was always there. Who knows how often it will show up. The thought makes my skin crawl. Maybe I should just end things while I'm still happy. Go out on a good note. I wish I could talk to someone about all this. God damn. Some deep shit. March 13th, 2022. Uh, approximately 1pm on the 12th. Popular graffiti artist C.B. Mayo. Akko Hiddenberg was found collapsed on the grounds of an apartment building in Kessenstad. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. The death of the 18-year-old girl comes as a shock to, no, uh, to not only local community members, but also to the, all those who are familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of death may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out foul play. And our proceedings with a full-scale investigation. Wait, she killed herself half a year ago? Then that means I've been here this whole time? Holy shit. What'll it take for you to forgive me? Please, end this. Just let me die. <laughs> Is this me? When did she draw this? I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. What are you hiding inside? Don't worry about what people think. Be proud. So, she did notice me.
Okay, so the whole, this whole time she actually noticed uh, Anita. That's crazy. actually that's insane and I ended up getting her killed I was so happy when my mom liked the first picture I drew the fuck that creepy ass fucking drawing oh hell no I could have had a different life, too. I guess someone finally did love me. Okay. You actually noticed me. I never thought you would. That's crazy. Emily, what should I do? They could have just hit, lived happily together. <laughs> but jealousy is. Uh, He's lethal. Anita, what's up? I'm sorry, Amelie. I'm such a piece of shit. I had no idea she'd do that. What are you talking about? Did something happen? I thought I was invisible. That I didn't matter. No matter what anyone had said, I didn't listen. Anita? But you and Maya, both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you, Amelie. You were always there for me. I'm... I'm going to go apologize to Maya now. Wait! She's gonna jump again. This time it won't be a loop. Oh wait. We can talk, just the two of us. Tell each other everything that's on our minds. Okay, okay. Don't go, Anita. Please don't leave me. Oh, she broke the cuss. She broke the cuss. Okay. That's a W ending. She was just about to do it as well. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone. And need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. 
There's no beauty in living like that. But I don't really mind. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love, and for those who love me, I want to keep moving forward and never look back to 18-year-old me. Damn, that was deep. That was actually deep, holy shit. This was such a different type of horror game. It wasn't even like... It was scary, but it wasn't even like... This was just deep, man. It was just deep. Interesting, though. It was very interesting. I enjoyed it. I I'd give it like a... Like a 7... 7 out of 10. I, I kind of wish it was longer, like, and I kind of wish, like... Moving day. It feels kind of scary leaving my hometown. Oh shit, there's more. But I'll be fine. I have my best friend with me. Okay, okay. That was good, man. That was good. I enjoyed that. Uh... Yeah, I haven't played horror games in like a while as well, and I actually I want to get on the like, I want to get on back on 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 the fucking, on the trend again, man. Get, start playing horror games and shit, cause I actually really enjoy these. Let me know, let me know what you guys want to see next. Be sure to leave a like if you haven't already. Drop a sub, drop a like and subscribe. And I'll I'll catch you guys on the next one.